There are three different roles that an insolvency practitioner may take when dealing with an IVA. The first is an advisor, and this is when they're simply advising a debtor as to whether or not an IVA may be the best route for them. They may then help them produce their IVA proposals to put to creditors. The second role is as nominee. So with their nominee hat on, they will then look at these proposals and write a report to creditors as to whether or not they think they're fit, fair and feasible. And effectively, whether or not they believe uh, that creditors should be advised that these proposals are attractive and they should be considered favourably. The third role would be once the IVA has taken place, if it's been voted in favour of, then the IP may become supervisor. And then their role is simply, as it says on the tin, to supervise the IVA and ensure that the debtor does everything that they said that they were going to do and, it, and sticks to the terms and conditions of the proposal. Thank you.